Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using Ambient Light Rejection, Technology Gain Times 4 and 5. So a few people have been asking this question about why we are no longer developing any form of silver or light screen paints ever again. This is due to the fact that when we started developing uh, the uh, Eclipse, uh, cinema it basically had the ability to produce amazing contrast but white levels were very a bit low and when it came to the silver eclipse or dark uh, silver I forget the name, how the name, the name we have for that um, the eclipse silver I think I, I forget the name of it but anyway when we started developing that screen paint it had high white levels and it had fair uh, contrast now with this technology superior we have the ability to produce both high white levels and great black levels or fantastic black levels at the same time which means there's no use in designing anything else when we have a screen paint that does it all. And on top of that, the screens can be taken outside. They can take on tons of ambient light and they look absolutely incredible. Now, usually in my demonstrations, I show off uh, a lot of lighting. I show off the black screens. I like to do a lot of white bright images because I like to show you exactly how bright the white levels are on the black superior. And this demonstration is going to be a little bit different. So I've had people contact me and say, hey, look, I've seen those projectors you have downstairs are 720p's. Those projectors have a 5,000 to 1, four, sorry, 400 to 1, 500 to 1, 800 to 1. My contrast is at 8,000 to 1. My contrast is at 12,000 to 1. My contrast is 10,000 to 1. I should have said 8, 10, and 12, but you get what I'm talking about. So anyway, just let me show you, even if you have light gray screen, or a light gray screen. Sorry about that. I'm going to back up there. And if you have a light gray screen mix or a light gray projection screen, it really doesn't make a difference how powerful your contrast is on your projector. You will never, ever achieve true contrast. It will not happen. I'm sorry. It's just not going to happen. And people want more depth. They want more detail when it comes to their, uh, their movies, when it comes to gaming, when it comes to TVs, and TV shows, and so forth. You're not going to be to achieve that with this screen. With It's kind of uh, any screen of this color or caliber, you're not going to be to achieve it. So we're going to do this. We're going to pop all the lights out, turn all the lights out. All right. We're going to do the star field demonstration. Like I said, the star field demonstration, there is no way to get around this demonstration. You can't calibrate or do anything special to your projector or anything like that. It is what it is. It's going to show you contrast or it's not so first things first I'll show you my projector I'm going to be using my ViewSonic projector this projector is a um, oh my goodness I think the name of this projector is WGXA it's 1200 sorry 1920 to 1200 it does full 1080p and it has a 12,000 to 1 contrast Showing you that even if you go out and buy a projector that's 12,001, 10,001, 8,001, even 20,001, you're just not going to get it. Some people feel that, hey, if my projector has a 12,001 or if it has a 20,001 contrast, I'm going to be the pull up contrast. It's not going to happen. So let's get this started. Let's take the lights out first. So you can see it's nice and dark in here. And let's remove what's blocking my projector. So you can see exactly what you're getting. And this is with all the lights out in the environment. And we'll get up close on the screen so you can see what you are actually really getting. This right here is gray, and this right here is black. Now it's funny because in one of the demonstrations, I pulled back the camera, and somebody says, Well, the uh, gray screen paint looks brighter, it looks better. No. It's just not producing black. It's producing gray. That's why that line you see here, right there, you see that line? This is gray, that's black. Ooh, you get really dizzy getting this close up on this thing. But that's what you're really getting. And that's a 12,000 to 1 contrast ratio on my projector. All right? Where I stand in the environment, that's what you're getting. This is why I like to do the star field demonstration. The star field will show you exactly what you are really getting from your setup, your screen. All right, so let's come over here and let's do, and keep in mind, like I said, if I bring any form of ambient light in the environment, any form, so I have my dimmers down. I'll bring them down, turn them on real quick. Any form of ambient light 
hits the environment, that screen is automatically going to start showing its true colors. Now keep in mind, I have ambient light here and here on my screen. There's any, there's really any, nothing touching the gray screen. This is the reason why you cannot use these screens in a fully lit environment because they will start to fade. Got dimmers over here. I can adjust my lights at will. I'll get right up on top of the screen. You can see the difference between the two. And like I said, any form of light in the environment. I bring those dimmers up nice and slow, any form of light. Doesn't take much. That's a 12,000 to 1 contrast on my projector. I can't even pull it up. Now, alright, let's go back, take our lights down again. And we'll grab ourselves another demonstration. There for a minute, just for a minute. Now you see that right there on the eclipse. On the eclipse, it's supposed to be black, not gray. This is what you get with twelve thousand to one on your. If you get twelve thousand to one on your projector, this is what you're actually are really getting. Pause this for a minute. I think I lowered my sound bar this morning because for some reason I couldn't get the sound to project out of my cell phone because that's what I'm streaming from my cell phone. So I'll turn it up just a bit there. We'll come back in a minute here. That camera to adjust a little better. See right there. See how it shows up on our screen with no problem whatsoever with the lights on. Now, we'll go back, pause it, take our lights out, show you what you're really getting. Some people think that my, keep in mind, my projector is 4,000 lumens. So people think if they get a high enough lumen projector, high enough contrast, they're going to pick up everything that their projector is going to pick up. Keep in mind, if I'm using this form of light mix, keep in mind, I'm not even getting the full potential of my projector. So I spent all this money, did all this research, and this is what I'm getting from my projector. See, even with the lights out, you are still not getting what you're supposed to be getting. Even with the lights out, you're not getting what you're supposed to be getting.
This is why when I have customers contact me and the first thing they say is, look, I got this light gray screen, I got this white screen, I got a very good projector. The minute I turn the lights on, it washes out. It's gone. It's not even there anymore. Now, if you want, I'll put the model number of my projector. I'll put everything at the bottom so you can check it out for yourself. So you can see exactly how high the contrast is on my projector behind me. So you can see exactly what you're really getting. All right, I hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'm Kenneth from Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using the Amulite Rejection Technology Game Times 4 and 5. This right here is my 146 inch Illuminous Superior Cinema. I actually kind of screwed it up a little bit. Sorry about this. Early in the morning is really early in the morning. My Illuminous Superior Amulite Rejection Cinema. It is very early in the morning. I'm, I think it's around close to about, I'm up at around 6. I'm going to do it earlier than that. I'm up sometimes around. I get my camera to focus a little better there. I don't think my camera wants to play right with me today. Oh man, I'm always up early in the morning. If I can get that focus to come in. If I can't get the focus to come in there, just take my word for it. It is early in the morning and I am up and I am, have a lot of work to do. But this is just to give you a bit of an eye opener on exactly what you're getting. If you buy a projector that has high contrast, the, again, keep in mind, my projector is 1080p, it has high contrast, it has high resolution, you know, it's a WXGA projector, and at 1220, at 1920, so 1920 by 1200, at a 12,000 contrast, 12,001 contrast, I'm just not, I would never get the picture. I would never get the true picture with a mix or some form of light screen paint or basically a, um, a, uh, a lighter uh, gray screen. Just, you're not going to get it. All right, hope you enjoyed again. Gotta go and God bless.